YouTube, let me tell y'all something, because a lot of y'all need to hear this, because a lot of y'all, y'all don't listen. Like, y'all need to understand something about people. I'm going to just clear something up for y'all, so then anybody who has any questions, y'all know exactly where I stand at with this specific situation. And bro, what I got to say is that you cannot control other people. Like, there's so many people in my life who try to influence the decisions other people make, who try to just change other people, and, and, and you just can't change people. Like, you cannot change people, so you need to stop wasting your energy trying to change everybody else. You need to worry about what you can do to change yourself. Honestly, the mirror is one of the best things that we have in this world. And if you look at the mirror and you analyze what you need to do to make yourself a better person, then you will make the world a better place. It's not your job to fix everybody else. But with all that being said, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy. Paul Eclipse, Sunny D drinking clips in the building with another banger. Now today is, is a different video. It, it's a really different video. Like, I'm so sick and tired of the cheese that 2K has in this game. It's like every single time 2K comes out, it's some type of cheese that you guys would have known would have been the game if you guys actually play it. I'm really convinced that these developers do not play their games before they release it. And what makes it even worse is that this cheese is just accepted throughout the 2K community. I don't get it. Like from the post hooking to the to the modded controller glitch to the speed boosting cheese the the crossover cheese like that shit is ridiculous man i'm so tired of it so i decided to make a rant video today because i played against somebody who 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 was using the post hook cheese yesterday and they man i just i don't even know bro but anyways i'm gonna hop right into the video if you think you're gonna enjoy today's content make sure you guys give me a subscribe just go ahead and hit that subscribe button until it turns red and make sure you tap that notification bell right next to it because you YouTube is weird you can subscribe to my channel but if you don't tap that notification bell you will not be notified every single time that i upload and make sure you guys as a as a nice gift to me i will really appreciate it make sure you guys hit that like button till it turns blue so more people can see my videos in the future without further ado paul eclipse with this banger let's hop right into it youtube youtube Listen up to this video and listen up loud and clear. I know y'all expecting me to come with my hey, hey, hey intro and give y'all the hype content that I usually give y'all. And I will gladly give it to you guys after this video. But this gotta stop. This gotta stop. Y'all see, it's two centers on the court one, a paint beast and a glass cleaning lock. And then it's me and my boy T with our three-point playmakers and our paint beast build but that ain't the issue here the issue is the cheese that is in 2k21 and the cheese that's in every 2k game now if you guys don't know earlier in the year it was a modded controller glitch where pretty much if you had the right controller you could just press l1 and it would give you a perfect release all the time because of the shot aiming tool that 2k has incorporated in the game but after they patch that and patch through you don't really see too much of that anymore at least i have not but now they have came up with something else the post hooking cheese if you guys are watching the gameplay you guys see that we turned it over and we already knew when this center was posting me up we already knew what was coming and y'all see i got my mic moving in the game chat because i start i'm not gonna lie i start talking trash to the guy because it's just like we should like why like and look at this and like look he's posting me up that's green every time there's nothing you can do to stop it he's posting me up and shooting post hooks from the free throw line i can't tell you guys how many times i have lost off of this one cheese alone if you're on the tools court and you give them the ball and they're doing this it's over there's nothing you can do to stop as you see they got a good game plan he throws up post hooks from the free throw line and then the other center that he's running with just grabs boards over the smaller guard because he know he can there's nothing that we can do at all there's nothing at all we can do and it's so frustrating 
having two bigs who can't dribble and who decides to come on the court and cheese. And you want to know something, man? You got to be a special person. Because PS5 comes out in less than a month. As I'm recording this video, it is October 13th. And you guys will probably see this video tomorrow. So for you to decide to come on this game every single day and cheese your way to a victory, I don't like you. I don't like you. And you see he got the miss right there, but we can't grab the rebound because he's so much bigger than my guard. And as you guys are going to see in the gameplay, it actually was a couple possessions that we actually got the ball back. But the thing about that is they're so big that one, you can't drive into the paint on two bigs. So they're going to dare you to shoot the ball. And if you miss, it's over. It's over with. And with the difficulties in 2K21 with the shooting as it is, you're probably going to miss a shot. Now, as y'all see, I got the steal there. And my boy T shoots, but he misses. And I'm going to just give y'all the conclusion. That's game. That's game. Now, of course, he got the steal right there. But they're going to get it back. And then that's going to be game. And on top of the post hook cheese, because I, <laughs> on top of the post hook cheese, there's this new cheese that everyone's doing where like you double cross and then you speed boost out of it and it makes you move. It makes you move like you're on something. Like why is this stuff in the game and why doesn't 2K patch it? And honestly, and honestly, I enjoy 2K. I don't want you guys to think that I'm going to be some kind of rant YouTuber because I'm not. I'm going to bring you guys the entertaining content. You know where I yell and do live commentaries and all that good stuff because I know that's what you guys want to see. But I had to get this video out because it's been too many times on stream where I'm raging because someone is coming on here and they're using shot stick and they're post hooking me. Shot stick either has to be nerfed or it has to be taken out of the game. I promise. I I'm telling y'all, YouTube, I put this on everything that I love. If I get PS5 on November 12th and I make my player and I decide to come out to the park and somebody is post hooking me and I lose, I'm going to break something. I'm going to break something. So I don't know if 2K is going to see this video or if this video is going to matter, but the community has spoken. He got his post hook badge right there. It's over. As I was saying, the community has spoken. You have to get shot timing out of the game, whatever the hell it is. Because everyone is cheating. It's not fair. It is not fair. Now, I know this is the current gen game where you guys are like, whatever, people are going to play it until next gen comes out. That's fine. But when next gen comes out, you guys have to make sure that game is spotless. You had two years to work on it. So that game better be spotless. Now, of course, it's going to be cheese heads. They're going to find something. But this post hook and that shot stick, that shit better be gone. I better not see it anymore. I'm tired of losing because of this. All right, now that that's out and over with, I just wanted to get that out there that I'm so, I'm just, if you guys haven't already heard with my voice, I'm so sick and tired of the cheese. I'm excited for 2K on the PS5. Hopefully they fix all this cheesy stuff that's in the game right now so that we can come with a more polished game come November 12th. But with all that being said, I do have some announcements for you guys. I am gonna include in today's video, my last video because I worked really hard on it. It didn't get a lot of love that I expected it to get. So if you guys haven't seen that, the link is in the description. And I also will include one of my other videos in the description as well. If you guys haven't already, it's attached literally on my video. It's in the description, all of my social media links. Make sure you give me a follow on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter so they can be notified every single time that I upload or about to do a stream. And make sure that you follow me on Twitch. I'm almost an affiliate. I'm probably about 10 or eight followers away. So make sure you guys give me a follow on twitch all those links are in the description below and also as i've gave you guys many hits and gave you guys many indicators in the video make sure you guys leave a sub if you haven't already turn that notification bell and make sure you guys hit that like button because it really helps my channel grow in the future and i'm also thinking about making a second channel that's going to discuss other topics that i like to talk about probably like finances and vlogs and just whatever else i decide to talk about so make sure you guys be on the lookout for that channel as well but with all that being said, 
I appreciate you guys for checking out my video. As always, it's your boy, Paul Eclipse, out with this banger today. Y'all boys be smooth. Peace.